talk about sustainability and design. We are Katie Annabelle, the founders of Cabeza Patata. Cabeza Patata is mainly a 3D uh, design studio focused on carta design. We also do crafts, uh, anything related to physical work as well. I will be showing a bit of where we work. That includes work for The Grinch, uh, work for Apple. We worked a lot uh, with them during the years, including Apple in Asia. We also have done big global campaigns, this one for Spotify Premium, where we got to see our characters all over the world and as well work for other tech companies like Google. And today we're going to talk about two main points. The first one is going to be sustainability in how we make physical work. And the second point is about sustainability in how we make digital work. So firstly, in our physical design work, we're going to be talking about sharing resources with others. And so for us, when we started to create our studio, when we put together our first ever website, we always decided to have that in mind. We didn't want to lose this sharing nature when we started. And when the pandemic came, it isolated us more. We felt that we were lacking the connection with the community. Our, our work wasn't getting better. We decided to swap our office for a new type of adventure. We spent an entire year traveling in a camper van and living just on the road while working at the same time. One of the advantages we had is that we were powering solar panels and we also could plug to electricity whenever we needed. And it meant that we had to be very efficient, but we had everything we needed. We had our fridge and our kitchen and we had a different sunset every night. After an entire year living on the road, we realized that there's no need for as, ma as many things that we think are needed for digital work actually are not necessary. Uh, the, ability, the, the ability of the people behind the machine is much more important than having big offices or having very powerful machines. So uh, this year, after the year of traveling, uh, we discovered our new place. We found our new workshop that is a shared space. And this workshop, which is in the centre of London in Somerset House, has a real focus on sharing. And for us, that sharing is about different materials, resources, different machines that we can use, but as well it's about the knowledge and the human relationships that we have with other designers in the space. Uh, the next step we're going to talk about is the sustainability in our digital design work. Specifically, we want to talk about how we should be conscious of new technologies and how we're teaching this to our students as a studio. We think that the first thing we should do is we shouldn't jump blindly without questioning things. Uh, that's very important because we live in an industry where everything is appearing new all the time. We have new technologies, new concepts all the time, and people just jump into them, usually because the promise of a lot of money comes first. People think that you need to have a most powerful computer to get good images, and it's not true. We focus on efficient work. Focus on an efficient work means that we constantly need to question ourselves, why do we want a faster computer? We have condensed all of this knowledge we have into our newest adventure, which is our Patata School. And that's where we are teaching students not just to press all the buttons, but to really think like a character designer and to make our students feel fulfilled with the unique and efficient work. We offer some free resources because we want to welcome more people into the design industry and make it accessible to as many as possible. We think that we have the ability to choose the future for ourselves and those around us. But we'll only get there by questioning power, questioning our own actions and the path that's been set up for us. Just like we did, changing our studio for a camper van around the world back to a more sharing space and creating a school. We really exaggerate that for other students and people in the design industry to create their own path too.